Doki Genyo, everyone, Star the Protagonist is here, and welcome to episode 4 of the Spending Spree series. For this episode, I will be spending over 30,000 V-Bucks. So the last one didn't really do so well, but this time, it's a lot better Nick, this time. So, uh, yeah, not much to say. Anyways, I hope you enjoyed this today's Spending Spree, and uh, you'll be able to see when the next Spending Spree will be at the end of the video. So without further ado, let's get right into it. All right, spending spree number four. I know the last one didn't do so well, but I'm hoping this one does a lot better. And nonetheless, we are also on chapter five, season four. Uh, the one season that a lot of us have been anticipating, considering that this is Marvel themed. I am really in, I do really do like the battle pass. And I know Gwenpool is tier one, and I know she's probably going to be my favorite, even if I get the rest of the skins. But nonetheless, it's time to make some purchases. So as you can see, we are in the Dragon Ball section. And the reason why is because the Dragon Ball cosmetics are set to recycle out of the shop really soon in about a few hours. So uh, I guess I might as well get the rest of these gear bundle because I did get the space pod, but I didn't get the rest of the stuff, which is the fusion emotes as well as the Kame staff and pickaxe. Uh, all right, getting the rest of the bundle. Dang. Okay, there we go. Okay, so before we add what I purchased, uh, I gotta get this emo out of the way. It is about to rotate out immediately, so I had to get this out of the way first. Now, what we're gonna add is we're gonna add this brand new pack. As you can see, I have Captain Marvel, and that is because I was able to get the Marvel Royalty pack which cost it like $30. So um, I had this with the help of Jaquan, my cousin. So uh, I really appreciate that. But yeah, since it doesn't really come with V-Bucks and is mainly just a, a money pack and it only costs like $30, I'm going to add 3,800 V-Bucks to the total since it comes with three skins, three pickaxes, three back blings, and two gliders. I know some of you might not like this, but hey, this is my spending spree, my rules, okay? I gotta be honest, this is one of the best packs I've ever gotten. But anyway, as we go back into the item shop, we're expected to see the Ariana Grande cosmetics come back. And uh, yeah, not much really returned. Honestly, I was expecting, I was expecting them to bring back the OG skin, but uh, that's a bit unfortunate. <laughs> But um, anyways, we're going down into the Marvel section and the reason why is because I've been meaning to get Bright Star uh, since she, Captain America, along with um, the other Captain America on the left, also returned. So I think she's probably the coolest out of the like originals becoming Marvel characters. And also, this is going to be my third Bright Bomber skin. Um, I guess I can just give my cousin Jaquan the Iron Spider skin, which came out like yes, two days ago. This is something that he he did. He this was something that he actually wanted. Um, ever since it came out, I was thinking about getting him either Deadpool or Wolverine, but I think he pretty much changed his mind on that aspect. So, regardless, I'm gonna get I'm gonna give him this gift. So yeah. We got the brand new Fortnite crew skin. This is the one I've been waiting for ever since I saw the leaks because she is a very cute. So 2000 V bucks as usual, Fortnite crew. But now we're heading into the item shop. And as you can see, we got the Scarlet Witch bundle making this return. Um, I already got the skin and 300 V bucks for the emote, the pickaxe, as well as a loading screen. Don't mind if I do. And if we scroll down, we'll see we also got the return of Mr. Shannon Tatum himself. Uh, I don't mean to say this, but i hoping I can come back to him another time. What? But now, I'm going to get Rogue's pickaxe, which is Hollow X Axe. Um, yeah, I've been meaning to get a pickaxe because I did not like the uh, setup I did with Rogue, but I can finally get this pickaxe. So, if we look in the item shop, as you can see, Meowtooth, the bundle, is finally here, but this may sound a bit controversial, but 
not really into me out i'm not really into the bundle as of now we do not care but there's not much going on in the shop um uh, i guess okay there's the wild frontier bundle and there's this emote um it's copyrighted as you can hear but um dynamic hush makes a return i guess i can get her for the time being and there's also another thing so um really not much going on in a shop but i might as well just get at least one or two things from the shop at least until black cat makes her debut in the item shop so uh dynamic hush is a skin i've been meaning to get i'm just been i was just waiting for the right time to actually get her i think now it's the right time considering the amount of v bucks i have so And I'm also going to get the festival pass. Now, I know a lot of people really not, are not interested in season fives, considering that it's KOG, but uh, I think this has to be the most underrated festival pass because I think the way they actually put KOG into this game is actually really cute. I think she's really cute in the festival pass. I mean, I know there's her item shop skin, but uh, I'll probably go for that later on. But yeah, I've already upgraded this whole pass now i can finally get her look at that it's here it's here after months they finally added this emote finally oh my god i will admit they did mess up a bit on the timing with the dance but i'm just glad they played the whole part of the song the entire part of the song and not only that, but at least they didn't go freaking Nightcore on it. So I'm glad they did this. So I'm obviously like, th this is a no brainer, man. I'm obviously getting this. We got the Robo Rebels bundle making this return and they got the, bought back the skin that I've been meaning to get. <laughs> I don't know what's their fetish for making like these thick skins. I mean, this is literally a thick ass robot, but I'm not complaining. I'm going to get her regardless because this is a skin that I've been meaning to get anyway. We got Black Cat making her way into the shop, and on Friday the 13th, which is perfect timing. I have no idea why they keep bottling in these guitars in order to like bump up the price. I I really really don't have an I really don't know why, but I, you know I do play Fortnite Festival, so I can't really complain much. Plus, at least for the for at the very least, all of these are separate, so you can buy these separately if you don't have enough to buy the whole bundle but you know me having to wait for this whole collaboration i will say god damn she is one hell of a, a hell of a hot skin what did he say <laughs> so i'm gonna be purchaser first you already know the drill and of course i am also going to be gifting the bundle to the lucky winner of the giveaway and that is sugary toxic 745 if i can find her on the list there they are finally all right so congratulations to sugary toxic and i hope you have a good time with black cat looky looky who's in the item shop Woo! i have not heard much about rubius but i know that he's like a content creator with over 40 000, well, 40 million subscribers and you know i've seen like a few of his videos and like i think they're pretty good and i honestly think that he deserves a spot in the icon series considering that he also does fortnite content as well so yeah, he definitely earned this spot. And I gotta say, this is a really awesome skin. I really do like the selectable styles. I don't really like the Mad Cat style though. That's just my personal opinion, but I do think his original style looks really cool, either with the shades or you can put the white hair on considering that he did dye his hair at one point. So I do like what he has going. The skin itself, along with the gear bundle, this is his Cat Wilson along with a sword so this is both a back bling and a pickaxe combined together there's also his emote which is the asmr keys and his rap which is actually reactive at night i think this is the first rap we've actually seen that is reactive at night time i'm not really planning on getting this whole bundle because there are other things i want to get as also i want to save up for the incredibles collaboration but at the very least i want the skin for now 
And by the way, I also use this code because apparently in the uh, for the 24 hours, he's going to be donating all that money to animal shelters, which is a really power move. I don't think any other uh, content creators ever done that before. So yeah, this is a first. So congrats to Rubius and yeah. So they apparently made these brand new Lego sets and they decided to bundle these skins along with the Lego sets. We got Spider-Man Zero, Mary Jane Watson, and Weapon X. I don't know why they decided to do this. Um, I think this is pretty much like just going desperate considering that not many people were buying the Lego sets. But hey, at the very least, they did make the skins separate so I don't have to worry about buying those stupid sets. So I'm getting Mary Jane Watson. I've been wanting to get her. Ariana Grande is finally back in the shop and they finally updated her original bundle which means I can get her pickaxe and her super adorable emote for only 300 V-Bucks. 300 V-Bucks for a pickaxe and an emote? It was obvious I was going to get this anyway. It was quite obvious. We got the X-Force set making his return in the shop, which means I can finally get the skin that I've been meaning to get, and that is Psylocke. And so, so when I buy this skin, because I'm obviously going to be buying it because I've been meaning to get this, but when I buy this, Psylocke will be my 20th Marvel skin. We are on the final clip of the spending spree. Honestly, could have made this a bit longer, but you'll see why once we get to the end of the video. But before we actually get to our purchases, we got to add the Fortnite crew, 2,000 V-Bucks as per usual. And I also got to add 200 V-Bucks since I was able to get the Amethyst Fangs, which was from the Best Friends bundle. So pretty much I got the rest of the bundle. That's 200 V-Bucks. And I also got to add the No Cure Emote. This was gifted to me by Journey. So yeah, thank you for the gift, Journey. And I got you when I get more V-Bucks. Don't worry about it. But ladies and gentlemen, where's my super suit? The Incredibles is here in Fortnite. I know I'm a bit late on this, but you know, I had to, <laughs> I was preparing myself for this since I had to get some stuff out of the way before getting to this. But nonetheless, we got Mr. Incredible Frozone, AKA where's, where's my, my super, super suit? suit. And of course, Miss Thickums here, uh, Miss Incredible. You get the bundle for 3,500, but yet the skins are 1,500, except for Frozone who's 1,800 because he has his uh, pickaxe bundled in. You also got two, uh, other pickaxes as well as two emotes so all of this for 3500 i think is a, a really great price so out of the three skins i'm going to be getting miss incredible because like god damn. oh my god god damn god damn they they really made these very accurate to the movie oh my god oh my oh my god man so And I'm also going to be gifting Frozone to my friend Juzu. And the reason why is because it's his, it's his birthday. So uh, I decided to get him at least like one of the incredible skins. Cause this, I think this is actually one, something that, this was actually one of the skins that he actually wanted ever since like the Incredibles actually got into the shop. So yeah, I'm going to be gifting this to him, especially considering this is his birthday gift. So uh, happy birthday to Juju. I hope you have a really good one. And I also hope you enjoy Frozone. And to wrap up this spending spree, I'm also getting the emote Dimensional. This is actually playing the song 3D by Jungkook of BTS as well as Jack Harlow. This is actually a song I really enjoy a lot. I'm so glad they made an emote out of this. I missed out on the last one, which was standing next to you. Now, I'm getting this one. So that is it for episode 4 of the spending spree series. Uh, I think for my next episode, it was going to be Halloween themed considering Fortnite Mirrors is on its way. So I got to prepare for that, especially considering we got a lot of collabs ready for this. For example, we got the second wave of The Night Before Christmas coming soon, as well as Saw, as well as Leatherface. And we also got Shaquille and Neil also making his way into Fortnite. So yeah, there's a lot to look forward to in Fortnite Mirrors. And I hoping that I can actually make a whole Halloween spending spree for this. But if I can do that, then consider that as the next spending spree, which will probably be the shortest one. But nonetheless, I hope you enjoyed this next this episode of spending spree. I thank you all for watching. And until then, this is Startup Protagonist signing out. As always, 
Goku Genyo, and have a startastic day, everyone. If you enjoyed today's video, then be sure to like, comment, subscribe, and turn those notifications on to join the Star Nation. Also, be sure to follow my Twitter, and while you're at it, check out my previous video. Now.